<clears throat> oh, girl, I didn't think I pressed record. <laughs> Hey Sugarfoot, welcome back to another video. You guys, we are going to get started on our styling series. Finally, I know y'all are glad we're finally back to videos. Baby, let's just go ahead and get into this. So you guys really love the fall style series that um, we did last year. Yeah, it was like eight outfit ideas for uh, large bellies. You guys really enjoyed that. And, you, and someone, or a few people actually, commented that they would love to have that type of video for every single season. So we're gonna do that. I feel like I'm going to enjoy it. You guys are gonna enjoy having ideas to be able to shop in your closet insert shop in your closet and or have an actual um, goal and idea of what you want to shop for if you are shopping outside of your closet in store online or whatever girl you know the deal so yeah let's go ahead and get into these ideas i have 10 plus size outfit ideas for you guys for spring and all of these are large belly friendly um i style them exactly how i would wear them so if it's not your cup of tea honey that just means it's not your cup of tea that don't mean you need to tell me how to do this that and the third it's i styled it how i want to wear it okay <laughs> but all of these ideas are going to be linked in the description below for you guys to check it out if you are shopping outside of your closet okay so let's go ahead and get into these looks okay fyi you guys are gonna see this phone hither with me the entire time because i'm actually looking at the pictures at the same time i'm describing the outfit to you guys and how i'm styling it so be ye aware so first outfit is very similar to what i have on now it's actually the exact same top that i have on now i found this ava and viv top from target not from target at Target. <laughs> so I would normally with Ava and Viv size down, but honestly, I probably would do the same size, you think, for this top, 4X. Yeah, um, I'm a size 22, 24. I have yet to lose weight, um, but that's where we are. And I actually like this oversized. So I usually wear it like this, opened at the top, kind of draped open a bit. And then I like the fact that this one actually comes with extra buttons on the inside, like kind of opposite, if you know what the, what I mean, right here in the boob area so you don't have any gay bitch. So there's that. I wore them with my favorite JCPenney jeans. They are the A&A &A jeans. They just snatch your waist in. They feel good. They don't sag throughout the day. My absolute favorite jeans. And I like the fact that they're frayed at the bottom like so like that. So I'm wearing it with those. They're skinny jeans, like nice medium wash and then i paired it with these target uh girl what these uh they like ten dollars i forgot the name of the, i forgot the name of the shoes like a birkin birkenstock dupe am i saying right birkenstock yeah so it's plastic but they're actually very comfortable very comfortable they're not slippery slidey type shoes and I think they're really cute for like a you know outside walking around you want to be comfy but you still kind of want to look a little matchy and cute wear these make sure your toes done so yeah you have all of that together I just paired it with some uh coat shades and the same accessories I'll be using all the time so that's the entire look and it's very big belly friendly because you have the oversized top you can wear it out and still not look slouchy if you pair them with a tighter fit jean you know what i'm saying do the opposite at the bottom than you're doing at the top and then you look put together but because of that i like to tuck in one side so people know that i'm not coming out here to play you know what i'm saying even though i'm looking comfortable so that is that look let's go ahead to the next look mm. the next look may look very much similar to the first one it is not the top looks very similar to the first one it is not it you can see that the top that i have on now is like more fine pinstripe and a lighter color this top is the 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 stripes are thicker and the color is slightly darker and is yet another oversized pinstripe top that kind of looks similar but i wanted it anyway because it just looks good so this one i actually like to treat more as a short sleeve or quarter sleeve top by rolling it and i like to wear this uh target one i would prefer to wear this one since it's more structured in the sleeve long this top actually in this outfit the full outfit well the top and the shorts are old navy not the full outfit but the top and the shorts are old navy i think this is a really cute cookout outfit the shorts are very comfortable right now they are on sale i'm not sure if they're going to be on sale still by the time you guys see this video but you know old navy always has frequent sales going on so i just tucked one side in like we do you know what i'm saying let let them know we're styling and profiling um and then the top i got there i think is a size 3x and then the shorts i got in a size 3x as well and the shorts are a little oversized but i actually like that because they're not snug it doesn't look slouchy so it's very big belly friendly because again it has spandex in the back 
even though it has the smooth surface in the front of the fabric you have that um, elastic in the back of the waist so you have plenty of room it has pockets <laughs> hello and then you can pair this with the same type of shoes that I'm wearing in the picture I got those shoes from Walmart they're just standard white tennis shoes that you can put with so many different things or you can wear it with the Target sandals that I had in the previous look or any other type of sandal or tennis shoe that you would prefer to put with this. It's very easy to style. I'll just use like simple minimalistic type jewelry with this. You don't have to go over the, I mean, if you don't want, if you want to, you know, do your thing, but you don't have to go over the top with the accessory. So very easy look with some shorts. So you can feel comfortable and still have this oversized, but comfy um, attire. So let's go ahead and go to the third look. Okay, so the next look is actually a nice wedding guest dress look for the girls with the larger bellies. Um, I actually am wearing a shaper with this. Y'all know I'm most likely going to be wearing my Spanx Thin Stinks shaper with this outfit. So I'm going to have that linked in the description as well. But this polka dot e, I don't know. It's not polka dot. What is this? <laughs> but this is a nice pattern satin uh, feeling dress. It has a cow neck. That's how you say it, right? It has a cow neck neck at the top. And the thing about this is it looks really good on. Like it doesn't droop too low, but you can, I think, adjust the straps if you want a little bit more cleave, you know what I'm saying? But with my bra, I actually liked it where it stopped. So the, the dress has a nice cinched weight that cinches in the right spot when it comes to you putting on the dress, you don't really have to do anything to style this dress. I, if I'm being honest, like once you put it on, it cinches you in the high part of your waist and you like, girl, I, we need to put a picture of me from the back. Hold on, let me look at it while so I can describe how my booty look while we doing this. Okay, so yeah, girl, the back picture should be up right here, right now, girl, listen. I don't have much booty, but I do today in this picture. It looks amazing. It just cinched very nice. I love how it um, kind of loosens up at the top and how it goes over the cinch and it just falls perfectly, I promise you. Like you're moving throughout and you know how sometimes your clothes can get out of place and you're constantly tugging at it. No, no, no. I didn't experience that at all in this dress, especially, uh, which is surprising because it is a satin dress and you know you have that on with your shaper. It just feels like it's constantly moving out of place but it is in place and it's very comfortable and you look very cute. I paired them with these ASOS mules that I got sometime last year, child, but they're very comfortable. They're not too high because the way me and my ankles set up, I can't be doing too high heels. So those, those are very comfortable and very springy. You can wear them with jeans or anything like that. And then we got this nice structured um, bag from Target as well. So this entire look is probably under $50. Definitely maybe under $50. <laughs> just this very affordable. So um, definitely check out that dress if you're doing some uh, weddings or you want to cover up your arms. You can also wear like a shawl or something over it if your arms are a pain point for you right now. You can definitely still pair that with this dress and it looks very well. Not very well, but it looks very good. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next outfit. <laughs> Okay, y'all, this next outfit is, again, another simple dress from Target that does all the work for you. We are not trying to do a lot of work. If you want to do a lot of work and that's your thing, then do your thing. But me, myself, personally, me, myself, and I, we are not trying to do a lot of work. We want our clothes to speak for us and we just look good in the clothes and throw on something real quick to accessorize the clothes and let's move on. That's how I think when I'm getting dressed. So this dress is has some busy print to it right it's cute print it's not too much and it's enough for you to be visible and somebody looking like oh my god i love your dress i literally got that a lot when i wore this to church um i was like i kept like, they were like oh, i love it love, it's so bright and colorful you know i'll I be running from color usually however color me and color are, are we're looking cute together now so this dress is very much nice and pretty and i love the fact that it has a little purple in there the it looks it may look a little blue in the photo but that color that you're looking at is purple is she blue green <laughs> yep <laughs> it's a nice purple color um and so we paired that with the bag that i got from target as well it's a nice puff uh what you described it as because you be using descriptive words oh crossbody <laughs> target <laughs> It's just a nice crossbody from Target. And the thing I love about that bag is that you won't have to replace the straps. You guys know all of my big breasted queens out there. 
it's hard to find a crossbody that really places on us in the right way. It doesn't like suffocate the suffocate the breast. Um, and this is an adjustable strap that allows a crossbody to hang perfectly at your waist without all of that extra pulling you in in the center. So I love that bag. Um, and it goes with so many different things. Um, so I paired that with, of course, another minimalistic type of necklace. Got my cross, you know, for Jesus, the Christ. And the shoes are from Torrid. Now, I hope they still sell these because I think they were sold out when I last looked in this exact shoe. But they have this exact shoe in a different color that was still in stock. But we are gonna check it for y'all anyway. You already know. They're gonna be linked in the description. But the shoe is very comfortable, wide width. I love the braid at the top. It's just a good, perfect spring shoe. And of course, Torrid always has sales and they're affordable if you don't wanna wait for a sale. So there's that. Um, yeah, so this entire look is a good spring, going to brunch. Um, you know, if you wanna put some heels to it and you know, you're going to church whatever you know it's a really nice dress that you can dress up or down and still look good i actually wore the dress again with tennis shoes and still looks cute so very easy dress to wear and very comfortable around the belly um and even if you want to add a little belt that shows steez then you can do so <laughs> okay <laughs> okay this next outfit or this next dress rather is from old navy i went into old navy tried to do some like buying in the store i bought three things i tried on like 30 but this is one of the th three things that i bought from old navy and it's a nice neutral polka dot uh, I thought it was yellow at first. Bean told me it was neutral, uh, just like a neutral color. It's a nice neutral beige polka dot dress. Simple, again, you want something that hugs your figure in the way that you're comfortable with so you don't have to do too much work. You see what I'm saying? Make it easy because we ain't trying to wear a whole lot of layers this spring, especially if you live somewhere like me that is extremely hot or rainy or humid whatever it decides to be that day or all three so basically this is a very simple thinner dress so i will say you definitely need to have a shaper on with this dress if you're somebody that doesn't want to like have all the lumps and bumps because you can easily see it in this dress i wore my thin stink shaper knocked right knocked all of that stuff right out the park so you i didn't really have to deal with all of that and the split wasn't too high to where you can constantly see the shaper as i'm walking and moving and grooving so that was something that i like also i'm five six for height reference for those ladies that are like okay how tall are you because i want to know how the slit would hit me and where the dress would stop on me and it stopped right up like right above my ankles i think looks at pictures to confirm yes it stops right above my ankles so um yeah i just paired it with the same uh um, white tennis shoes that I got from Walmart. You can do it with some sandals, like the tour sandals that I showed you or whatever sandals that you have in your closet. Uh, you know, those things that you already have there. You don't have to buy anything else up. And then we paired it with the Target uh, Croc, what you call it? She, Croc skin crossbody. Okay. <laughs> We paired it with the Target Croc Skin Crossbody. And this is another bag that is uh, big boob friendly. I just adjusted the uh, the holes, you know, the little buckle or whatever to get it to the length that was good for me. And it fits very well. It sits on the waist very well. And it doesn't like hug my chest. I actually feel like it was made for larger chest. So that's another option if you're looking for a uh, crossbody in that style that is a good option for the big breasted folks out there hey girl let's go ahead and go on to the next outfit okay this next outfit is another very simple outfit which is the theme over here picture yourself going to a nice game what you say a baseball game or brunch or casual day out or shopping or whatever and you have on this nice Amazon orange bodysuit that I think is very cute with grabbing attention, but not too much attention. You see what I'm saying? If you want to like, you know, you single out here and you want <laughs> an eye or two, hey, you give you something a little bright that brings something to the eye. You know what I'm saying? We actually paired it with this uh, Target dress, wore it like a tunic because we're going to repurpose the things that we buy. It's a very long oversized dress i actually got it too big so <laughs> that's why we're really wearing it as a tunic um but you can also get the same dress in the right size i would say size down i think we got into what a 3x mm -hmm. 
and I should have got a 2X. It is Ava and Viv, so they do run a little larger. Whatever you're buying for them, if you want it to be more form-fitting, I would size down. So this one is a little oversized, so I would size down if you decide to get it and still wear it as a dress, and it would still look good as like a cover-up or a tunic. So that's how we paired it with this outfit. I got on my favorite A&A JCPenney jeans because I just love them and I need like three pair. Um, and I just love a good medium wash jean. It just goes with so many things. And then the same Walmart shoes that y'all saw earlier. Ain't no thing. Just put all of that stuff together. Oh, and that Target bag. And then you get yourself a little wrap. You know, you do your hair like so like that. Or you could put it half up, half down. And you'd be cute. Have it out your face. You know? the looks so very simple look um easy perfect for games days out with the kids you going to the zoo or something like that i mean you ain't gonna get it dirty at the zoo no, no. yeah <laughs> yeah i was like you're not playing with the animals like that right <laughs> i guess i don't know girl let's go to the next outfit put on your scalp that's not oil base is what i meant to say because uh -oh. it the hey girl oh my goodness hey little girl <laughs> oh my goodness <laughs> She's <laughs> like, who's she looking at? Yeah. Back to the beat. <clears throat> Y'all, this next outfit is actually my fave, okay? Because I stepped out of my comfort zone a little bit, you know, showing a little thigh. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of thigh. It's a good thigh. <laughs> A good thigh day <laughs> showing a little thigh giving a little prep uh bean actually has did most of the styling on this particular look what was the skirt that you had it with at first i don't remember i think it was the peplum it was i think no it was the leopard yes. it was the leopard oh i hate that skirt was you didn't know it's fine <laughs> but the yeah that would have went very well so bean actually originally styled this outfit with a leopard skirt that had a split that I got from Shein that I don't really care for anymore just because the way it feels on me. So we went with this skirt because it is a good skirt. Such a good skirt. This is from, the skirt is from uh, Sign Blake's Amazon. The drop, she got like 30. I don't know. This could be like her third or fourth drop or something. But um, I'm going to link skirts very similar to this one if they don't still offer this one in the essentials for Amazon drop because they do have that like you know amazon drop you shop it for like 30 something hours and then the the line is gone but they're but the things that sell really well they bring back and add to their essentials line or something like that so um yeah i'm gonna keep looking make sure that this pops on there i hope it does because it's such a good skirt and honestly yeah you all think oh my gosh it's pleather oh my gosh I'm gonna get it. it is spring and it's summer girl do not wear this one it's hot don't wear anything pleather wise if it's super hot or make sure you got some breathableness in it. So you see that slit, right? That thighs out. Air is getting under there. So it ain't too hot. You know what I'm saying? And then no sweat and stuff is happening and all of that. So anyway, you can tell I just really like this outfit. So we paired it with a graphic tee that we got from Target because what we're going to do is save some coin but still give the look. The top is old from Old Navy, I think, or Tort. One of the two. Both of them have really good denim tops, so I'll probably look and see um, who has something going on at the time we need to link so to, you guys can get the best option if you are shopping outside of your closet. Um, so I love the graphic because it has Ice Cube on there. He is so fine. I know he married, but he's very fine. Um, and the dunks, we wear dunks with everything. <laughs> so if you are somebody that wants to get into sneakers or you're already a sneaker head, you're trying to figure out how to style your sneakers, if you're a sneaker head, you probably already know how to style your sneakers. But if you want to get some, some dunks, you can put them with everything. So many things. All the things. All the things. It don't even have to match color wise. It's actually perfect if it doesn't. Word. Everything. You will get your money back in the first month. <laughs> what i don't think it's and it's not expensive it's not an expensive shoe and it's a very nice sneaker and it's very comfortable and it gives you a whole look without you being uncomfortable so if you are someone that really wants to get into shoes but you want to get into heels but you can't wear heels right now try sneakers um so yeah wearing that i actually bought my dunks in men's size i think i sized down a size and a half um, and that actually helps if you're looking for wider shoes because the men's shoe is typically a little wider than the women's shoe so there's this at um and again what what do you see the target bag 
it's gonna show up in many places. You're gonna see it many times from now, even when it's sold out, because I wear my things. So that is, again, is a good bag. People were talking about how they had their bag sitting in their favorites and sitting in their cart, and they were debating on whether to buy it, buy it. If that's something that you feel like you're going to wear a lot, you wanna add a little color in your look here and there, but you want the base of your look to be black, and you don't wanna shy away from adding a splash of color, get you some bags that have some color. I'm trying to branch into that too. So this entire look is like really cute. This is actually going to be like a cute date night look. If you're going to something like a concert or where else can you go? Like mini golf? Yeah, casual date night. Like not no cute restaurant or nothing like that. Like casual, y'all out, y'all going to be a little active. Girls night, the things, you know, friends night, whatever. Game night, Game night. yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this is a really cute multi-purpose look. Uh, and if you already have stuff like this in your closet, of course, you can style it this way. Uh, J Bean just draped the denim over the shoulder. I'm like, okay, bro. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next look. Okay, so the next outfit is from Walmart because we love the what? Walmart. So I actually shop Walmart online. Y'all know we work with them a lot over here. I shop them online every time because they have a better selection plus size wise online than they do in store, especially when you're looking for stuff that is pops of color, trendy, fit, well, <laughs> just uh, the things that you know you can go there and buy something real quick. I'm always navigating to the Eloquy Elements line. What's that girl name? Sophia, Sophia Vergara. Uh, Tara and Sky, and sometimes Time and True, depending on what the item is. And Scoop, I will actually lean toward too, too, but they took away their 3X, so I'm kind of mad at them a little bit, but. Hopefully they bring it back. I don't know what's going on with these people that they're trying to snatch away plus size items, but that's neither here nor there. This dress is from Walmart. It is a part of Eloquy Elements line and the shoes are also from Walmart. They are time and true, I wanna say. Time and true normally has um, wide width options when it comes to shoes. So if you're looking for wide width shoes on Walmart, I would select that brand because you're gonna get most bang for your buck and cute shoes options from Time and True versus, you know, grandma um, shoes they be trying to throw on everybody and grandmothers don't even wear them. I don't understand why they have them out, but you know what I'm saying. So this is an entire look, literally two things. I didn't even add a bag to it. It's just a really good look. Like this dress has nice like pleaty what would you call girls got nice texture the split isn't too high in the front i still wore my shapewear with it you can't see it it was just very comfortable i love how it cinches the waist i love the length of it it just feels really good it's perfect for church if you want to repurpose it for brunch date night all of that you can put it down a little bit give a little cleave if that's your thing you know you can do that you can pair it with heels and or sandals and or tennis shoes so I have these nice sandals on from Walmart as well. They have like the little, what is it called? Spikes. Yeah, like little spikes on them. I think these sandals come in black, clear, and white. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, it's just very comfortable. They fit, and you all know I got a swole foot. Fits comfortably around the swole foot and the good foot. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, it fits very comfortably. And I think it went really well with this dress since the dress is like a plain color and then you draw a little attention to the shoe. And then that's your thing, girl. It's just like an entire look, really cute. I can see that dress with like a baseball cap and like a denim jacket draped over your shoulder and some sneakers. Hire Justine to style your outfits. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought about that when <laughs> So this next look, the entire look is Target from head, well from neck to feet. To Okay, <laughs> from, from head to curve, oh, that's cute. Look, <laughs> oh, that's cute. <laughs> okay, so the blazer is a nice purple blazer from Target. Um, then, of course, you see that bag again. That top is really the dress that I wore as the, what was it, what is it? Tunic. Tunic in that, uh, girl. Orange body suit. Thank you, with the orange body suit from Amazon. This is that dress. You can wear it as a top, you can wear it as a dress, you can wear it as a cover up or a tunic. It has so many purposes. So yeah, we just kind of buttoned it up at the top, had it unbuttoned at the bottom, tucked one side in and kind of draped it around because it is long and then kind of like folded it some type of, you don't have to do all that if that's not your thing, but I like the way it look, especially when it come down so long on one side, it just looks really good and just kind of draws attention to the entire look instead of focusing right on the center if you're trying to move attention away from your belly if that's the thing so jeans are like fit really well on 
larger bellies if you're getting a good size pair of jeans. So Ava & Viv is one of my favorite brands to shop at Target. It ain't like they got a bunch for us, but Ava & Viv is really the good one because they have spandex in their, or elastic in their uh, waistband as well. It's like a black elastic band in some or most of their um, jeans. And it just feels good around the belly. It doesn't feel like it's too tight or anything like that. And that line is one of the lines that doesn't stretch out as I'm moving about the day. So really love that line of jeans. Those are, these jeans are those. Girl, these jeans are even big. So yeah, paired it with the purple blazer that is from Target as well. Um, and the green bag and you got an entire look. The shoes are from Target, right? Mm -hmm. Wide with strappy sandals from Target if you're not into the higher heels, but you want a light, nice little cute block heel. Um, these heels are nice as well. I will say they are a little slippery. So if you want to get like one of those gel inserts so you don't slide to the front and do this around the shoe, cause we ain't got time. Um, then you probably want to do that with the shoe. But outside of that, it's a good shoe. <laughs> okay, now let's get to our very last outfits. So showing you another way to repurpose the same sandals that we had with the other Walmart dress with this Walmart dress. So this is a busier dress and I still have it with the spike sandals and it still works. I love, love this dress. Let me tell you how I give off a little, you showing your thigh, you know, this is the year of the thigh. You show a little knee, a little thigh this year out in spring. And you know, if that's your thing, I'm not trying to push you to do nothing that you don't want to do. But this feels, it just looks really good. I love the fact that um, the print isn't grandma print, if that makes sense. Like you wear it right and you put it on, you have it fitting to you well. It's something that you're going to enjoy wearing and you're going to wear it more often. Now people are getting a little mad about the fact that all of a sudden floors are coming back. Floral in spring, groundbreaking. However, if they do it right, you gotta try it on sometimes and see like, okay, this is actually gonna work for me. Cause I too will normally run away from a whole bunch of florals and print. Y'all doing a lot, that's not what I asked for. Give me something simple. That's normally what I would think. But now they're putting it in silhouettes that will really work with our bodies and curves. The brands that I actually care about still offering plus size clothes are actually paying attention to the silhouettes of what they put these florals on and you're gonna wear it with something that doesn't feel matrony that makes sense so yeah this dress is actually perfect because you do not have to wear a shaper with this dress it's not extremely thin i will tell you now if the wind blow <laughs> too strong to the right <laughs> just me you know just don't wear it on a windy day <laughs> but outside if it's not a windy day you'll be just fine it is a really nice dress um like i said i'm five six and it comes a little below mid thigh um and i didn't wear a shaper with it at all i have this it has this nice stone ring in it is this stone yeah, it's like marbly stone type ring. It's really cute, very elegant. Um, and love the fact that it has a collar. So if you want to wear it all the way up and have that structured look at the top, you have that option. Or if you want to do like I normally do, keep the buttons open and kind of flip it, you have that option as well. It's a quarter sleeve dress and it's kind of flouncy. So yeah, it's very, is that the best thread? <laughs> flouncy? I'm trying to get better with vocabulary when it comes to, <laughs> that was good? Okay. Yeah, it's very um, girly. So you have that girly silhouette in this dress and you could again, pair it with sneakers, pair it with sandals and pair it with heels if you're a little shorter and you don't want it to be, you know, if you're a little bit more petite and you don't want it to be riding up and people just being able to see all up under your dress because this is a little shorter. But if that's your thing, again, this ain't, that ain't none of my business, but that's, that's your thing, wear it how you wear it. And I'm sure it'll look absolutely amazing. The um, bag is from Walmart and I think it's Scoop. So yeah, it's like a, it's giving off neutrally-ish, but it's really green. Um, in this, in this picture, it's actually as green as the tree. So I don't understand where that mix up and happen. But yeah, so that is my favorite Walmart dress and that is the last outfit. All right, y'all, I hope you guys enjoyed all 10 of those looks. Again, those are looks that I would wear and how I would style them. If you have any questions or if you have any like other outfits that you would like us to style during this season for spring and summer, definitely put those suggestions or questions or whatever your comments are in the comments below. I will definitely be sure to chat back with you guys there. Everything is gonna be linked in the description. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, the TikTok, 
and subscribe here girl because we are gonna be doing this every week so y'all have a great rest of your day and i will talk to you guys later bye